thanks again to the guys in the band, and once again, Jeff, for part of our own panel, coming in and sitting in. This is kind of a, a little bit different rendition of when the saints go marching in.
You're killing these balls. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. We want to thank you very much for having us here again. Um, for me personally, this is the... Well, I've been here every year since the year 2008. Wow. And uh, you've always been this to us, family, and we, uh, we're very grateful that you would have us back again this year. Um, before we go on with the rest of this show, I just want to see by a show of hands, how many of you have seen us before, or this is your first time? <laughs> I just want to see how this is going to go. Um, this is our tribute to Benny Goodman tonight. We're going to be having some fun playing some songs that were Benny's hits, along with going into some of the things he did in his book that were lesser known. Um, but we opened up with a song called Avalon, and now we'd like to do a song uh, that goes to a very, you know, a very tender spot for us because, well, the, the, the title of this describes the love lives of most musicians. And this is called All By Myself. <laughs> no, no. Well, I've seen a recent picture of you. <laughs> Never mind.
Okay. Do you have to have anything you'd like to say about this next song? I'm very scared of it. <laughs> uh, Fats Waller's big, I can do this and nobody else can, rent party, uh, cutting contest, showpiece, is called Handful of Keys. And only the most foolhardy pianists attempt it as a solo at this time of night after so much water. <laughs> but even more foolhardy is trying to keep up with this young sprat who plays it at tempo disturbed the neighbors, Mach 7. I mean, this thing is so fast. We just played it. Oh God, you, you missed it, didn't you? <laughs> I have more stamina than I thought. I'm not tired at all. So wish us luck. Wish me luck. These guys are fun. Not to mention he plays in a different key than his right. Sorry. I'm doomed, but that's okay.
This one was written by U.B. Blake, and uh, this was featured prominently in the Benny Goodman story. May, may I tell just one quick story? Of course you Dave. Can, yeah. There was a time, and it was a jazz at Lincoln Center, uh, the Kennedy, I'm sorry, Kennedy Center, that uh, it turned out that U.B. Blake and Benny Goodman were on the same bill, and the promoters asked them to do a duet version of this tune. And they, in, during rehearsal, and Dan Barrett told me this story, during rehearsal, they started playing, and Goodman actually stopped him and said, no, you're playing the wrong chord. <laughs> <laughs> and, and the reason is that in the middle of the tune, uh, you're gonna hear us too. Because that's what Benny did. But the original, uh, the way uh, you wrote it is, uh, So he played that, you know, because he wrote it. <laughs> and, Grid and Gridman actually stopped him and said, no, you mean that's the wrong chord. <laughs> I think that's great. <laughs> Only Gridman, exactly. <laughs> all right, so sorry, I didn't mean to move. No, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> the romantic mood is set now. <laughs> <laughs>
You know, I gotta tell you, we, we absolutely love it when an audience applauds for the song before we play it. Because, you know, just in case you don't like what you hear, at least we have the memory of the applause just kind of fading off into our memories, so.
I'm glad we're closing tonight. I think so too. Well, we're the, we're the last band here tonight, so I guess that means we can play all night. The last band. The last all right. Band the last band standing. The last American band standing. <laughs> Jeff, what would you like to play? I don't know. I think we should bring it back down. I think so, too. Okay. What what ballad would you like to yeah. hear Dave play in the worst way? I don't know. I can play it in the worst way if you like it. That comes very natural to me. Moonlight Serenade. Oh, that's Moon Glow. Moon Glow. We had Moonlight Serenade, Moon Glow, and Moon Indigo. What is it with these M's? They're all really rude. It's our cow cow heaven set. Hang on to your seats, folks. Which one are we doing? Okay, oh, so we're doing move. Let's take it down. Maybe a little bit less. Let me set it.
Thank you very much. That was well in Moon Glow. I've never done that. I, I haven't either. I think tonight was a very special night. Yeah. Well, you think, know what? You think we'll ever do it again like that? You know, it? I, I'm just going to do one more thing. I have to say, it's always a special night when I get to be on stage with you two. Thanks, man. You're wonderful. Yeah. I love you. You know, the, the coolest thing is that, Jeff, you and I have known each other a long time. You, were, you weren't even shaving I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I met this guy when I was 15 years old. The crazy thing was he was only 16. But, you know. <laughs> we've had a lot. We've had a lot of fun. <laughs> Why don't we do something fast? Well, it's a China boy. Okay, I love doing that tune, but we are in an era of political correctness. You can't call it that anymore. Really? It is now East Asian Child. That's what we're playing for you right now, East Asian Child. No, it's true. Japanese Sandman, that great tune from 1920, has to now be called Far East Asian Ground Glass Person.
beneath that, stand up a second now, let them see you in your full glory. Beneath that calm, cool exterior, ladies and gentlemen, is a seething volcano of passion. <laughs> Work with me here. Uh, If you're having as much fun as we are, you're drunk. <laughs> All right. What would you like to hear? Something slow and pretty. How about Moon Dance? Yesterday's. Rose Room? Okay, I'll tell you what, we're, we're going to be doing another Benny Goodman set on Saturday. And so we're going to get to a lot of those tunes we just heard on that day. But uh, do you know Rose Room? So let's do Rose Room. You know, we always consider it a very special day when someone requests a song that we know. <laughs> um, I, yes, it's a, it's a nice feeling. It's really good. The thing is that how those fall.
very much. All right, folks, we've got time to do one more song, and then we will be back tomorrow at the 12.30 set. And, uh, ah, yes. Our wild, passionate drummer has worked himself into a frenzy. He ain't making frenzies with nobody. But if you could do me a big favor, if you could, if you can give a big round of applause to my good friend Jeff Barnhart. Fantastic house, thank you for And my name is Dave Bennett. Thank you so much. We're going to play one more song for you, and um, this is written by Louis Prima. This is called Sing, Sing, Sing.
If you have a cell phone, you know where this is going. If you have a cell phone, put it on. 